Red hose, drop them. I don't need them. Yellow shirt. Drop it. Don't need it. Dagger, I'll sell. Coif, I'll sell. And actually, that yellow shirt might be worth uh, selling. Fighting the city is probably illegal. Oh, yeah, that's probably, probably it. No, no doubt. I just find it funny that I knocked him out and was able to steal from him right away. That's, that's incredibly funny. That's incredibly funny. He did try to grapple me, and then I pushed him away. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, I kinda kicked his ass. Welcome, Henry. So where's this other guy? Oh, that's Milan. That's Ringlet. So Milan's outside, I actually ran past him. But we gotta go fight uh, Ringlet first. Actually, uh, just to get rid of it, probably want to just sell the stuff to you. No, don't pickpocket him. My respects to you. So you will just you'll just buy this at a at a discount then or at a at a lower price. That's stolen. What are you trying on me? Get the hell out of here. Oh Jesus, I'm sorry. What the hell? Jesus. Okay, certain traders, I guess. Still fine. Still fine. Oh, Jesus, he's all the way up here. What's this? Tavern. I'll have to rob from that, steal from that guard as, as, as soon as I get here the next night time. Who's this guy? I discovered a nest. I discovered a nest. I discovered a nest. Hey, Tim, how you doing, man? I discovered a nest. I want to know, man. I want to know. What you talking about? A nest. Did I read that right? Is this it? This just looks like a pile of rubbish. What? Did I read that right? What if I just turn all this shit off for now? And I turn my quests off for now. 
I turn that off. And I go back to the map. Hold on. Nest. It's apparently on the ground right here. I was gonna assume they mean this, but why is this a nest? Oh, right there! There's just a piece of gold in it. What is- what? Okay, let's go back. That's really cool, but... <laughs> it's kind of driving me nuts trying to figure out where that freaking nest was. Why was I assuming it was on the ground? I don't know. Probably just me being a dumbass, but that's all good. Put that on. <laughs> Evening, Vlad. How you doing, bud? So I wonder if that's like a, a thieves' guild, quote unquote, kind of thing. Then maybe to stock stuff in. Oh, and now that I examined it, it actually shows up here. It shows up on my compass. Okay. All right. Anyway. Wait, Keep what? Going. Oh, he's going to take my sword. I'm going to have to pay him. He's going to take my sword. Why? Such are my orders. Do I look like someone? Oh shit. Shirt? Oh, yeah. A likely story. I can't pay him. Fuck. He's gonna take my stolen stuff. He's gonna take my sword. As you wish. Are you yanking my pistol? Hand over all the stolen goods you have. I'll be keeping an eye on you. Now you can enter. Oh, shit. Hey! You don't move a muscle. Oh Surrender. shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> God damn it. Oh shit, when did I save last? Hopefully it's saved once I fought that guy, because that should be- it should save during that quest. What? It didn't save during the quest? It didn't save when I beat Steven? I still have my fancy sword, though. But I didn't sell all that other shit. Oh, f fart on my ass, man. Oh, shit. <sighs> put away this. There you go. Wait, no, wait, 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 wait. Put away, put away the other stuff, too. Food, put away two of these. Put away ten of these. So 
So does that mean I have to talk to you again? Learn how to pickpocket? God almighty. No, okay, we already did we already did that. Yeah, lesson learned, you only have one chance. I guess that's fair. There's probably an ability that lets you get a second chance on that as well, but... That's all good. You live with your choices. I should have just paid his ass. I knew I should have paid his ass. Alright, so now we gotta sell all the stuff. Uh, that isn't Hot stolen place. first. So, sell the bludgeons. Sell the scarf. Sell these. Uh, sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Nope, don't sell that. I'm wearing that, you idiot. Sell uh, that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Yes. Can we do something about the price? Sure, why not? Okay. So we've got an 85. Eh, uh, 85. Are we agreed? We're getting there. Just drop the price a bit. 25 more. robots from Vlad. Thank you very much, man. Finally, a reasonable sum. And now we sell the stolen stuff. Because she'll let us sell it. Maybe it's because she's not in a city. Or maybe it's because she's living next to a freaking... A freaking Thieves Guild member guy. And 15 more robots. Thank you very much, Vlad. Thank you very, very much. Uh, is that it? I thought that was another thing that I had stolen. But I want to wear this. I want to keep that. I'll keep the axe as well. So we'll put the axe away as well. Uh, as well as our arrow. We'll put the arrow away. Okay. <laughs> Fill the cup! This stinks to high heaven of stolen... Let's agree on the... The full cup always terrifies me, because then it incentivizes people to drop massive amounts of bullshit. Since it's you. That's better. Drop it a bit more, and we'll call it a deal. Night, Vlad. Enjoy your sleep, bud. I knew we'd come to an arrangement. Explode. Not quite. <laughs> Not quite menu, or not menu, wow. My brain just died. I saw the green name and the M, and I have two green name M people. Meow. Thank you very much for the 90 bits. No, not quite an explosion. But definitely, definitely appreciated. Even though it's a 90, an, a combined bit of 90, that gray one is still only, still light. They go by the color of them, they go by weight. So the gray one is light. The... Purple one is heavier, so on and so forth. Which is generally why people want to drop just like a bunch of single bits. Even if they're going to tip like a hundred, they still just drop a bunch of single ones because then it'll fill the cup and then the next person who drops like a hundred can explode it, kind of thing. It's one of those fun little min-maxi things, which is not a word I would typically use in in that regard, but anyway. You're really, really enjoying those, uh... those Rockly smiles. Which I'm not, not, a, not at all against. You're really enjoying those. So put that away, as well. I don't know if I want to put my axe away. Because if somebody searches me, and I lose my sword... But I won't be losing my sword, because I'm just going to pay the guards from now on. But the question remains, do I, would I, would, do I want to risk that? And the, the answer to that is, I don't want to risk that. So I'm going to take the axe anyway. And I'm going to save 
because I did all that shit again. We'll sleep for one hour. For science, does it save if I get up in the middle of my sleep? Or do I have to finish sleeping for it to save? I have to finish sleeping for it to save. Really? Okay. I guess that's fair. That it doesn't let you, uh... Min-max the sleeping. Oh, God. Oh, no, the Kappa Cannon. The Kappa Cannon. Alice. 500 bits. Thank you, Alice. Totaling a bunch... Totaling 2,005 bits. 2,005 was a good year. How are you, Henry? They are tickling me, and I can hardly see them. The- oh, the emotes? Yeah, have fun with them. I'm not- I, I'm not a Nick sub, so I, I mean... In some way, I wish that I was so that I could- I could use them for him, but... Wait, I still gotta fight people, right? So I gotta go back to... Quests. I'll show this. No, 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 you can only three turn. You can have only three things active. Well, get rid of those. I don't need those on. I don't need that on either right now. You can only have three things tracked at once. That is fair. That is fair. I, I appreciate that. Okay, so now go to the map. Now go here. Fast travel, except... I want Wowie bits. Yeah, Wowie bits would be nice. You know, I'm actually quite surprised that, uh... Hold on. I'm actually quite surprised. Oh shit. I was hey, caught. You. Don't move a muscle. I actually, yeah, that's what I was gonna say. I'm actually quite surprised that uh, save it or tra fast traveling doesn't auto save. But then again, I, I like the fact that this game only has like two ways to save: sleeping. You can sleep, or you can drink one of your potions. Okay, so now, yeah, okay, I'm gonna do that, that, and that, and that, and go to here. And Go to here, and go to here, and try and rob from him again. Oh, there's another guard there this time. Fuck me. Can I pickpocket with two of y'all here? I got a key. I'm gonna go for ten seconds. I got the money. New pickpocketing perk. Be a bit more careful. Nice. I, I would have liked to have the key, but I'm, to this. I'm fine with the money. Well, I wonder if I could tell this guy that I won't keep it at all. I've got your coin. I'd like to see that bastard's face when he finds out it's gone. I'll give you some of the Groshen back, like I promised. And I've got another job for you. 25 Groshen. What's this other job, then? Everywhere you go here, you will see wretches like me. Poor souls, they don't have a pot to piss in and have to beg. Then take a look and rat eye at all the gentle folk with their noses in the air. Looking out only for themselves, with not a moment's thought for the poor. Well, from one fine lady, you could get arms to feed the whole lot of us here. Arms for everyone? <laughs> that would be quite a purse. But I'll see what I can do. That's the spirit. In return, I'll teach you something useful, and you'll get a share too, of course. Steal 50 Groshen from the rich woman? 
No, I'd rather steal it. I can give him 50 for my own money. That's kind of nice. I'd rather steal it, though. Hey, watch it. Shut your damn mouth, guard. Can't neglect the pentapot. Nope. That cauldron emote is the best. Be a bit more careful. I will kill you. Okay, let's fight Steven real quick. And I might just not rob him this time. I might just leave him on the ground. Because he had a bunch of bullshit. Uh, brawl. Oh, yeah? Yep. Here you are. Alright, let's fight him. It's gonna have me aiming at the ground again. Yep. Oh, I can't rob him this time. Okay. Oh, there it is. Does he have anything? I'm taking your 32 Groshen. You know what? Fuck you. I'm taking everything. I don't care. You're nobody to me. I can sell it to Milpapa. Assuming that the guard doesn't stop me this time. And if the guard stopped me this time, I'll pay him with the money that I just got from that guy. His pants. And, uh, I know there's a mod, I'll look at it maybe the next time I play, or if I take, like, a lunch break today, if I decide to stream for a long time, and I take a lunch break, I'll think about, you know, maybe closing the game and looking at the mod for the game, because I know there's apparently a mod for this that doesn't limit the amount of saves you can do. And if we're being all honestly, I mean, I love the idea of the limited save, but... For the, for the purposes of streaming, if it ends up becoming so much of a headache that... Basically, I have to... It's it's one of those things where you basically... You have to be, like... Honest. You have to be like, I'm not gonna use it to save scum. I'll only use it to save... Without using, like, a, a potion or something like that. Because there, there is a mod for the game out right now that... Unlocks the... It gives you unlimited save potions so you're able to save whenever you want but I'll have to in invoke like an honor where uh, an honor system where I can only save in specific instances and not save scum the game pretty much what is she downstairs then Can I get you to move? What's with you? Hey, you! What did I do? Wait, what All the right, hell? Enough. What the hell did I do? I've had enough of your shit. When I said clear off, I meant Oh, right am I now. trespassing? I'm sorry. Well, you won't forget this in a hurry, because it'll take a nice oh, pile of coin me. to fix it. Oh, 15 bucks? That's easy. I've been given a secret task. You're making a serious <laughs> mistake. You think I'm so stupid as to fall for such a fairy tale? <laughs> Not a chance. Had to try. Yeah, I'll pay. Damn it. Here's your coin, then. Fifteen is you not terrible. You purged yourself before the law, but I'll be keeping an eye on you. You can be sure of that. I didn't realize I was trespassing. That's my bad. Okay. 
or I'm in a private area. Oh, it's somebody else's house. Okay, I thought that was like a lounge or something. That is fair. Oh, you could do some purpose like if you wish us to come to the law. But decide quickly because the guard will soon lose temper. You've been committing a crime. Local catch poles will try to catch you. What penalty will occur by show by the account kind of under the compass? Even if you match the the clutches of the law, you're still not in the clear. People will remember your face for some time. The bigger the crime, no longer. Okay. That's fair. That is fair. I completely understand that. That is my bad. That is my bad. 100%. I'm just gonna beat you up. Ringworm. Jesus Christ be praised. Aren't you ringlet? Milan says I have to beat you before he'll take me on. And you're that blacksmith's lad, right? What do you want out of it? You're not living in the dirt here like the rest of us. Maybe not. But why shouldn't I try and beat some coin out of him too? Yeah, and you can pass it on to us that need it. If you want to fight me, you dandy, then pay up. Or fuck off. I mean... I'd be more than happy to pay to beat your ass. And then steal the money that you do have on you. Thank you for the 24 Groshen. Thank you for that. Thank you for that. Thank you for those. And goodbye, sir. And actually, I will go back here now so that I can sell the stolen shit, save it, and not have to deal with that bullshit again. I am being a smart boy. He's wisening up. He is a wise man. Hello, my lady. Who's that guy? Who's that guy, lady? Who's that guy? You feel bad for the dude? Why? Rough times. It is rough times. So, so this, so this, so this, so this, so. But for the moment. Is we have a toast to make. To your valor, my sword, and our victory together. <laughs> Two months in a row, welcome back, Delta. Hey, all. <laughs> How you doing, bud? Thank you very much for that resub, dude. You know, the best ways to make me feel happy. Surprising me with that, and a blood for the blood god, which is hilarious because I just beat up a dude for money. Which makes me even happier. So we're not going to get a lot of money out of this, but it's definitely worth selling anyway. Seems you're trying to flog me stolen goods. So you better drop the price. I'll drop the price. It's Let's all good. Let's agree on the price then. It's all good. Dude, you are my lady. I will drop the price for you. Agree? Come on. That sounds pretty interesting. <sighs> Let's, let's agree on 16.5. Are we agreed? Used final offer. She's going to say no. That's better. That's all good. I'll go for that. That's all good. Hey, I'm, as far as I'm concerned, that's basically free money. I beat up a guy, I stole his clothes, and then I made money. So, <laughs> that's, just fr that's just free money, and I got an extra, an extra buck for it. So, I'm all good here. Just in college. There you go. Been missing you, man. I haven't seen you for a bit. Alright, so what do we have? What is... Let's arrange by this. So we got an axe. We got the ring that we're going to have to bring up to that dude. We got 300 gold. That's so good. That is so good. The torch does 7 damage. I can hit people with the torch. That's awesome. I'm also not using my sword right now. Let's equip the sword at least. And we'll equip the torch as well. I don't know why those were not on. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. 
by this. What is this? Health. Oh, that's how much it heals me by 30. And I have 100 HP. Oh, that's, those are actually not as good as I thought they were. What do these heal me by? Oh, those just stop bleeding. Oh, those just, just stop bleeding. Okay, that's nice. Okay, do I have any skill points that I can use? I do. I have a pickpocket and a skill I can learn. Comrade. Uh, increases your chance of pickpocketing someone with the same charisma level as you. Such people are usually dressed similarly to you. Okay. Or secret pockets. When looting corpses, you'll find more money! What? 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 Oh my god, I wish I had that before I beat that guy up. Yo! Tell me about it. Oh my god. That is my fa one of my favorite skills to have in any RPG. Find more shit when looting. <laughs> more shiny things. Please. Sleep for an hour just to get that quick save going. And again. What? Alright. Onward to victory. Uh, we need to go north to this one. But before... Actually, no, wait. We can go, uh, we can go fight Bitch Boy. There we go. Let's go fight Milan real quick. Let's let's just wipe this quest out. Let's wipe the floor with this dick. Milan don't know shit. Please don't search me. Please don't search me. Please don't search me. I just had... I just got my 300th gold. I do not want to pay a guard right now. I mean, I streamed la I streamed yesterday morning for like five hours, but I played this for like five hours yesterday morning in the actual AM AM. Like, I streamed from like, you know, five thirty six o'clock in the in the AM until like, I don't know. We we wrapped up at like ten thirty five ten thirty eleven o'clock something like that. So I mean, we we did we did an early day stream. You just happened to miss it. Oh shit. Get out of my way! Get out of my way! Is he on the roof? There he is. Milan! Fight me, dick! Yeah, twat. I'm taking your hat. Let's fight. <laughs> I ain't getting around the bush. Pretty good hiding. And I made a grosh to two in bets. You scallops fellows are good for my purse. Yeah, and you're good for mine as well, because I beat up your boys and took like 30 apiece from them. I paid two and I took 30. And then sold their shit. So they're basically naked now. And I can't even be blamed for it. Ooh, nice knee. I can't even be blamed for it, because they were unconscious on the road. They might have been burgled by some bandits. Oh, Jesus. Okay, okay, okay. Milan ain't messing around. Milan ain't messing around. Alright, 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 alright. Alright. Man, I haven't gotten a hit on him. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 okay. Pull your shit. Got a new perk God. in something. I'm not sure. I didn't see it. Someone's gonna have to let me know. I got a skill in something. Nice hit. Nice hit. I'll give you that one. That was actually a nice hit. Tastes like magic. Thank you for the follow. 
Come on, give me that haymaker again. There you go. Oh, baby, come on. Oh, nice hit. Nice hit. A little bloodied from that one. That was stupid. I should not have approached. You're going to cry now. I mean, I'm not going to cry. You're going to cry, bud. Ooh. Agility skill point. Missed. I did. That's clear. Ooh, this guy's... He ain't messing around. He ain't messing around. Milan ain't messing around. Okay. He's about half HP. Okay. 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 I think the knee only drains stamina. Man. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Actually, let me let me try something real quick. I can't look. Warfare, dude, we're leveling up in this fight. Oh, Jesus, nice clonk. Okay. Fuck up. I don't know how to do a special move. Is it G? I don't know. I haven't been taught how to do anything like anything like what he's doing. He's almost done. He's almost done. Come in. He's going down. Let's get that. No. No, 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 no. There it is. Dunzo's loot. I will take your door key. I will take your 31 gold. I will take your trunk key. I'll take your pointed green hat. I'll take this and I'll take this. Thank you very much, Milan. Surely the hat would have fallen off by now, <laughs> right? Objective started. More fights. You won. There's always a brawler in Rite whose fights people for silver. Maybe I could beat a question out of them. Okay, so just more fights will start appearing then. Alright, then let's, uh, actually keep that one on right now. But we're gonna go to the good thief. Once we sell all this stuff. 329 Groshen, man. Door keys. Did I get a second pair of trunk keys, or did I just get all the trunk keys I got? Okay, so we just gotta find his house, pretty much. <laughs> let's go to home real quick. All oh, hats just super glued. <laughs> How you doing? Tastes like magic. Good to see you. Well, before we do anything, let's wash. Wash as much as you can. So does that clean uh, everything? It doesn't. Does it clean everything? It did clean my clothes off. Okay, so it is cleaning us.
This is my lady. I'm gonna go ahead and guess, Meow, that you just subbed tonight. Because I've never seen you use Nick's uh, emotes before, prior to today. I'm just gonna go ahead and give that a quick guess. <laughs> Thirty-seven for that, Jesus. And some working boots. Nice. So we're not gonna get our full amount. We're probably gonna get like twenty-five or something like that. But trying to flog me stolen goods, eh? I. As long as we can both agree on. We're fine, lady. We're fine. Give me like twenty. Twenty-five. I'll give you one extra, please. Agree. We're getting there. <sighs> what about this? Ah. Fine. Well, that's a decent price. All right, now I'll go back and save real quick. Oh, dear God, this game could last for thousands of hours. What are you doing? Teresa, I want your booty. Okay. I'm actually gonna probably sleep for like... Maybe only one hour then just to save it. Eat a little bit. Brings us up to 98. Hell yeah. And now on a mission. Let's do. What is it? Jesus Christ, Mill Papa. All right, we need to go. We need to go all the way up there. So we need to go north across the bridge. Teresa, what you doing, lady? Is that the bridge? That's the bridge. Laughing is a prime of necessary oxygen for remembering things. Fair. Oh shit! 170 bits from Ziff. Thank you very much. Oh shit, Ziff has that 1k bit badge. Oh no, what are we gonna do now? What's happened to you? I've walked all the way from Kuttenberg, but as you can see, I'm barefoot. My feet are fade to the bone. Don't you have a strip of clean cloth for me, good sir, so I can swathe my feet at least? I don't actually have any. Unfortunately, I don't have any, but I wish you good luck. Oh, well. Forgive my delaying you, sir. Rip.
damn Ziff. All from watching ads. I appreciate that. More than you know. <laughs> I am not gonna carry that, man. I got things to do. I got things to do, man. What's this? I got things to do, people to talk to. What are you going on about, dog? Yeah. There's another shrine over there. I'm actually very curious if the shrines around the world are actually Kickstarter names. If that's so, that would be the coolest way to do it. That would be the coolest way to do shrine, uh, like Kickstarter names and thank yous. So your head hit a moving ceiling fan? Damn. My ex, uh... My ex's fa uh, father... Tried to lick... A high-speed ceiling fan while he was drunk. Did not go over very well. In fact, he... He, <laughs> he may have ended up in the hospital that night. Okay, so this is the miller. This is where I'm supposed to go. Ooh. Very hard. Giggity. I do really want to break into it, though. Miller white chick. God be with you. Miller Peshek from Ratoy sent me with this ring for you. A ring? Here it is. Useless fucking bauble. You must be Henry, right? Peshek told me about you. What the... Why did you throw it away? Do you know how much trouble I had to get it? Peshek said it was important to you. Like I said, it's a piece of junk. It was just a test to see if you've got the balls to work for the miller. It's a custom of ours, testing fledglings in the trade with a nice little wild goose chase. We need to see if you'll be hobbled by pointless principles, or if you're willing to use your head. Congratulations. You passed the test, and now we'll have a few jobs for you. How can I sell stolen goods? What am I to do with these things I pilfer? No one will buy stolen goods from me. Buying and selling stolen goods is a crime. But if they're worth something, I can make sure they're... Uh, properly cared for. Not that I'd buy them from you, but I could, uh, store them for you. And you'll get some coin for taking care of them before. So if someone loses something, and I happen to find it, I can bring it to you to store, and I'll get Groshen for it. That's the arrangement. <laughs> I've got some goods here whose owners might miss Well, them. shit, I wish oh, I would have hung right. on to my stuff. Let's see what we can do about that. I wouldn't be having half price. Whoa! Treasure map? A map leading to some treasure. Dude, that's expensive, though. He has 20 lockpicks. <sighs> Who needs a key? Skillbook for opening locks? Uh... Uh... Uh, I can sell the piercer for 236. Oh, I should have waited. I should have waited. Chad, I messed up. I messed up, guys. 
I was so close. It's all good. Uh, I'm gonna buy... Who needs a key? I'm gonna buy the treasure map. And then I'm gonna... Each lockpick is 23? Each lockpick is 23. Just out of science, how much is this going to be? 695. Well, that's uh, that's not what I'm going to... No. I'll sell back 17 of them. So I'll buy three lockpicks, a treasure map, and who needs a key. You know what? I've got, fi I've got five lockpicks, don't I? I have five lockpicks. I don't need... I can, I can buy lockpicks from you if I need them. For now, I'd much rather have the 120 I'll have left over. I'll buy the... I'll buy the skill... Oh, I can't read! I don't even need this... How, how am I supposed to read a skill book if I can't read? Maybe I just buy the... Well, I can't even read a map if I can't read. Okay. Uh... Screw it. I'll buy it. I'll buy it. Whatever. Can we do something about the price? I. Agree? That's not enough. <laughs> See now, I knew we'd come to an agreement. Damn, I got like 20 off on that. Uh, oh god, yeah, being a I'm just gonna go to the codex then. Uh, reading is a very rare skill in the Middle Ages, and a common blacksmith's son certainly wouldn't have been literate. You can open a book and try to make sense out of the glyphs, but in the end you will have to find someone who can teach you at least the basics of reading. Once you've acquired the skill of reading, you should be able to make use of it. You can read descriptive books if you, if you wish, but the true wealth of learning is in skill books. Of course, it's not entirely easy to learn from books. To fully understand the text, you have to be very good reading uh, at reading skills and read the books repeatedly. The quality of your reading is also influenced by the environment you read in. Generally speaking, a place that's good for rest is also good for study. You can tell if you find a blah, blah, blah. Nice. Okay, so... Out of curiosity. Go in here. Read. <laughs> it actually looks inel ineligible. Oh my god. Who needs a key? Or Ho Endes Aeki. Ta Fritz Galkne Timia a pair. Hertha Lernig Hete Ratfo Pikigen Pikigen is an Senatala Pratfo a Tiefs Udanes Udasino Papranesk Papranesk Odent Edifsevi. I can actually I can actually read this. At first glance, it may appear that learning the art of picking is an essential part of a thief's education. Appearances don't deceive. I can actually read that. Uh, I will study this book when I'm back at my house, though, because you can see that down at the bottom there, I can actually study it. Now, what about this? Does this... Taumberg... Mershal led Merhol Merhoyed Merhoid and treasure is by a well Treasure is by a well off of a creek south of Talmberg. South of the crossroads of Talmberg. Cause you can see the compass rose is facing north. Okay. Okay, so that one actually that I can I can actually find. Nice. Now I'm curious. Hold on, I'm actually going to do a quick goog. And I normally don't like googling these types of things, but I'm going to do a quick goog. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Mm-hmm. 
the the internet has saved me. Okay, now if I go to my map, I'm here. So let me let me Quest Tipster. Where is a well? Cause this is the triangle. Right? This is the triangle, I think. Is there a well? There's an activity giver. Is there a well south of Talenberg? Wait, where is... Merholds something? Quest Tipster? The fuck is a Quest Tipster? I wonder if I go back to Talenberg, how mad... Robard is gonna be at me. How mad is Sir Robard gonna be mad at me? Or how mad is he gonna be at me? Not how mad is he gonna be mad at me. That doesn't make any damn sense. Alright, now watch this shit. You guys ready for this shit? I wonder if there's stuff out there can, I, can, I can do. Or up this river, because there's a road going up the river. In fact... Let's check up the river. Why not? Is this the road? It is. Let's do a quick... Discovered Rattay Woods. Ah! Is, there, is, is this its own map? Probably not. Wait. Ah, we'll, we'll explore later. Finally took down Cerberus. Hell yeah, Ziff. I knew you could do it. I believed in you. So we'll grab a quest from this guy. And then I actually have an idea of a situation that y'all are going to enjoy quite a deal. Yo! Yo! You got some shit for me to do, Boyle. Well, training. I do have a lot of money. Stealth I'd training. I'd like you to teach me how to be better at stealth. Certainly. Uh, beginner. I'd like to practice. It's probably gonna be basics. like seventy gold. All right. Sixty. It'll cost you. Yeah, sixty. I'm guessing that that's gonna be the same Maybe for like beginner time. level stuff. Do you need help with anything? Just in time. There is a certain matter I need resolving. I have some scores to settle with the commander of the Talmberg Guard, and I want to get my own back. You may have heard that Sir Robard of Talmberg is a stickler for oh, having no. all his gear neat and tidy. The commander of the Guard? Sir Robard? I'm already confused. Just tell me what I need to do. It's like this. I want you to break into the Townberg Armory and steal a few Waffen Rocks with the coat of arms on them. Ah, and once Sir Robard finds some of his guardsmen's equipment is missing... He'll see to the commander of the guard, who's the only one with keys and answerable for their safekeeping. When Robard finds out he's losing things from under his nose, he'll have him whipped. And I'll get what I'm after. Satisfaction. Take at least five Waffen Rocks to make it a proper stink. <sighs> Sir Robard is my bro, though. Consider it done. What am I to do with the Waffen Rocks once I have them? I'll burn them to get rid of the evidence. Just make sure you don't get caught. Okay. Basically, I can't get caught, though, because Sir Robard is my boy. He is my best friend. He is my dude. I'm gonna get rid of this for now. Gilly, that guy, welcome in. How you doing, man?
get this keys to Telberg Armory. There's gonna be so much stuff. Alright, but first, let's travel back here, hopefully not have any issues along the way. I know there are events that can happen on the road. Bad and good. Yeah, Waffen Rocks are, are, are types of shield. They are types, types of uh, shield. That's what those are. Okay, watch this. Put it away. Put it away. Exit. Go to bed. Apparently this is how you confirm, or you add something to your personal inventory. I'm gonna sleep until 6.30. Apparently this is, this is according to the official post by the game that to confirm something as yours once stolen, you have to deposit it in your own inventory and then rest to add it to your personal inventory, to add it to your own belongings rather than being marked as stolen. Which actually, now that I think about it, that's what I did the last time, but I just, I didn't realize it. Because I think we stole a couple of things, deposited them to save, to, or just deposited them to sell, and then upon grabbing them the next time, they weren't stolen goods anymore. Yeah, look at that. They're mine. They're mine now. Or not. Never mind. They're not mine. Interesting. Okay, so maybe that's wrong. Maybe that is wrong. Interesting. They don't look like they're stolen when they're in in here, though. Yeah, steal all. But it's my stuff. Also, this is completely broken now, I guess. Okay, so apparently... Okay. It's a time-based thing depending on how valuable the stuff is. So because this is worth a bunch and that sword is worth a bunch... Out of curiosity, I'm gonna try something. Deposit that. I'm actually going to... Deposit this for now. I'm gonna redeposit the stuff that I did have in there. So two of these. Uh, we'll deposit. Yeah, we don't need to deposit that. Uh, ten bandages, because I don't need to carry this many. Let me try something real quick. I gotta go out. I found the best challenge for Binding of Isaac. I gotta be honest, I really don't care. <laughs> I really don't care about challenges for Isaac, to be honest. I'm glad that you found something that's fun, but myself personally, it does not, I, I'm not interested. Not to sound rude, but. So it's based on time. Oh, you can't sleep any longer, okay. Because I guess you can only sleep for a specific amount of time every day. That's fair, that's fair. I also don't play the Pocket Edition, so that's another thing. 
I play Isaac on PC. Well, that confirms our, our thought earlier. That confirms our thought earlier that uh, you can't sleep too much. All right, read, and then we're going to try and study this real quick. Study. Oh, you don't have a... Yeah, okay, that makes sense. I don't have the skill. Fair. Fair. Can I study this? I can't. I just have to... I just have to find that. That's fair. Okay, well, I've slept for 12 hours. It is the middle of the night. Is this still stolen? Those are still stolen. <sighs> Shit. Well... I guess it, it, it's... I don't know. I want to be able to use my sword, but... Deal with fire? What do you mean, deal with fire? What does it mean, deal with fire? Can I, like, put the fire out? <laughs> it seems a bit... It seems a bit weird, but that's all right. Uh... Well, we'll put that on. You know what? We'll actually just wear this for now. We'll wear this for now. We'll deposit that and see if that's gonna... Do what I want it to do. We'll actually just deposit the sword as well. We'll take the axe back for now. We'll deposit this, we'll deposit the sword, and we'll see if they actually do what I want them to do. We'll see if it's actually a time-based thing like they say in... Yeah, because this became mine. This was stolen. No, 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 no. Okay, this, this was stolen. I stole this... From one of the guys that was passed out, the ones that the one of the guys that I fought, that was stolen before. Now it's mine, so it is a time-based thing. But maybe it doesn't have to be deposited. Maybe it's just the amount of time you have it before getting caught. It they kind of just forget that it was a crime. Maybe. All good. I don't like that this still has a star next to it. All right, X. Torch. Okay, I don't want the torch equipped. That's what that's what they're trying to tell me. Okay, anyway, enough of that bullshit. Let's uh, let's do some positive stuff with our life. Can I sell to you now? Will you buy stolen goods for me now that I know how to do it? Oh, there's so many things God to do in this game. With you. Oh wow! How did you get mixed up with thieving? Can I sell stolen goods? Do you have any work for me? I like to try picking. Oh my god, he has so many things. You've an honest trade. How come you got mixed up in crime? Evil times, the harvest failed, and there was no grain to mill, and a child to feed on top of it all. I had no choice. And meanwhile, the lords in the castle and the monks in the monastery stuffed their craws to bursting. Where's the justice in that? So you took justice into your own hands, is that it? And now you take whatever you need? Pull your head out your ass, Henry, and take a good look around you. Wars come and go, but nothing really changes. It's the poor that do the dying, and the nobles who reap the rewards. We have to survive somehow, so why concern ourselves with morals? Some of mine explaining this basically what this game is. It is an open-world, hyper-realistic European RPG set in the 15th century Bohemia during the Civil War. That wasn't really a civil war, actually. During the war between Hungary and Bohemia, uh, and basically what is now the Czech Republic. And it's yeah, it's it's a realistic RPG with a with like hyper realism, whereas you can bleed and die from bleeding out with a paper cut and a cut. You can get diseases, sickness. It's it's yeah. There's a Steam Steam link. Read up on what it is. It's yeah, it's a Kickstarter game that came out a couple days ago. Finally, after uh, being developed for the past several years, I was a Kickstarter backer on the game and. I'm now playing it, and uh, yeah, that's the brief synopsis. There's a bit more research you can do on it, but it is an incredibly deep RPG that is very niche and not for everybody, but I love these types of games, so. 
Would you happen to have any work for me? Of course I would. And, surprise, surprise, it's another ring. You like Not rings, Peshek. Properly done this time. Proper hard work. And who else to set the task to than you? The ring leader, so to speak. <laughs> The, the ring leader. Is, one of the rich townsmen left his ring behind the last time he went to the bars for some wenching. Oh my god. Too drunk to see it, no doubt. And now he wants it back, and the bars deny all knowledge. Why not turn to the bailiff? Why not? Because he doesn't want anyone to know about his bath house visits. And the girls in the bars are wary of selling the ring in case the bailiff does start looking for it after all. So we'll make life easier for them. What do you say? Oh, absolutely, Peshek. I'll get your ring. Done, provided I get something out of it. Don't worry. You won't be left short. The ring's hidden in the chest in the bathhouse madam's chambers. Come oh. right back with it once you have it. It's in the madam's chambers. That's going to be a rough get. That's going to be a rough get. I might have to bang my way to the top. Just like real life. All right, let's go here. I know part of the kickstarting campaign or one of the things that they had talked about was that there are goals that have timers on them and I wonder if that's that golden ring around it if that like slowly goes down as the time passes because I know there's certain quests that will like complete themselves like I, I've, I've heard one of my friends who's currently playing this game he uh, was doing a quest like later in the game he's been playing for like 30 hours though uh he was like way, 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 way later in the game, and he started a quest with a guy who wanted to go hunting with him, and he's like, oh yeah, we can go hunting, and then he got a notification, quest failed, randomly while he was out in the walking in the wilderness or along a road, and it said quest failed, and the guy just basically left without him because he was sick of waiting. Because remember, this game all happens in real time. It happens in real time, so... I'm wondering if one of these quests is going to... I'm pretty sure the one with uh, Sir Robert is not going to auto-complete. Because that one's that one's not like time-based, I doubt. Going and getting some shields. I'm sure that one's easy enough to happen at any time. You're just a wandering trader. Talk to me, bruh. What you got? What kind of trader are you? Jesus Christ be praised. I do love my Jesus. You're, you're not a... Okay. You're just wandering. That's fine. I figured you were a wandering trader. You're not a wandering trader. You are just a wandering man who, when he's at his place, is a trader. Okay. Okay, so where are the madam's chambers? You are the madam, right? Now you're the proprietor. Thank you for the 200 bits. Tastes like magic. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Thank you. Ring for the bass. Working boots. All right. Oh, shit. Hey, what are you up to? <laughs> Chat, of course she had to come up, freaking start walking up the stairs as soon as I was there. God damn it. I'm really lucky they had a balcony. Peshek! 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 I got your ring, baby. The ring leader. I have that ring for you. Excellent. 
They'll be hopping mad at the baths once they find out. Here's your reward, and don't turn it all into drink. Part of with the ring from the bass. 55 groschen. Sell the stolen goods. I've got some goods here whose owners might miss them. All right. Let's see what we can do about that. Ooh, treasure map 12. Royal St. Nicholas. Who's that? Park picketing dedicated to old St. Nick, patron of St. Athese and pawnbrokers. Ooh. Oh, look at this. Length 40 pages, progress 0%. That's cool. That's cool. And he actually sells lockpicks for cheaper than the other guy. The other guy was 23. You can take that. You can take that. You can take those and that and those. Uh, Honestly, you can take the poor quality air that I've been carrying around forever. I don't need it. I don't care about it. So I'll be paying you out 76. I'm gonna buy the treasure map. So I will be paying 61. That's not terrible. I'll buy that book later on once I can read. By then I'll have a lot of money, hopefully. Can we do something about the price? Why not? Holy crap, it's almost 5 a.m. here. I'm gonna crash everyone. Hope yourselves a wonderful night. Bye, Grim. Thanks for hanging out, man. 45. What about this? Well, now. A little more and we'll shake. 50? Satisfied? I'd almost shake on that. Ah! Fine. Oh, that's a decent price. I genuinely love having the skill that makes me get that final offer. That, that final offer skills were real good. Are you not stolen yet? You're still stolen! You're still stolen, goddammit! Become unstolen, please! <sighs> okay, what do you got? What do you got for me? Oh, this is Rate. Interesting. What? I'm actually going to put the book away for now as well. I almost feel like I don't need to have the shovel on me, but I'm going to carry it anyway. Might as well save it too. How's my favorite stream doing? How are you doing, Walnut? I've slept too long already. Shit! <laughs> Can I eat yet? I can't eat yet. What's my nourishment looking like? 74. Do I have food? I don't have food. <sighs> Fuck. Do you have food? That is wood. Thank you for the host, man. All right. That's what I'm supposed to steal from. I'm almost positive that's a stable over there. Can you fast travel back there? You totally can, holy shit. Let's go north. Let's go north. Do I have skills that I can use? I do have a strength skill. 
Uh, Gravedigger we already know, but we don't know of these. Clinchmaster gives you a gives you a one third higher chance of overpowering your opponent in a clinch. Or you can carry fifteen pounds more. Uh yeah. Hell yes. Of course yes. Absolutely yes. One thousand percent yes. Not even a question about that one. What is this? Ah! Just some beer! Interesting sight. And a fish trap. What? Trout! Ooh, eat. Da foo, da foo, da foo, da foo. How's the imaginary wife and kids? I don't have imaginary wife and kids. Thank you. Can I go across here? Or is he gonna complain? He's not gonna complain, it's not deep enough for him, okay. That's interesting that there's a... Is it, is it even... It's marked? Wow, that's... That is definitely news to me. Holy shit. Nice. Okay. That's really cool. I appreciate that quite a bit. Dafu, can you please not be an idiot? <laughs> Thank you. What the hell are you trying to... Are you, st are you tap dancing on your keyboard? You spilled cereal on it. That makes sense. <laughs> but, <laughs> like, I hate to be an inconvenience to you, but if you spill shit on your keyboard, you know you can click out of the chat window so that you don't spam my chat with a bunch of random nonsense. Instead, it'll just, like, not type for you in here. But, you know, that's just me. I hope your keyboard is doing well. Nico, how you doing, man? What's this? Oh, we already found that shrine. Northwards! Onward to the Northington. Is this the merchant? Oh, that's not a... Uh, there's an interesting site over there, too. What? What? Oh, I want to go touch it. Is that Does that, like, just show me where they are on the map now? Or did I walk past that and not notice it? I probably did, because I walked up the side of the road. Okay, we're going to have to go over there as well. Because mm, I want to take all the stuff that is in there. Glad you're well. Glad you're well. See, I'm not up because I can't sleep. I'm up because I chose not to sleep for the last day, and now I'm just instead awake at strange hours. Okay, I want to go see that interesting sight. This looks like a better Oblivion, except it's nothing like Oblivion. But I appreciate that. There, it's it's nothing like Oblivion, from like a, a, a thematic standpoint. The only thing that they have in common is that they're both set in medieval times, except Oblivion is set in uh, fan fantasy, a fantasy setting. It's set in Tamriel. This is set in Bohemia, the real world. That's a nettle. I, mean, I don't want to take it though. Oh, I'm so far past that interesting site. Shit. Well, I guess we're just going to forget about it for now. It's all good. Let's keep going north. It's like oblivion within the magic and fantasy stuff. I mean, 
even still, it's not remotely close to Oblivion, though. Like, if you were to take Oblivion, like, its core mechanics and make them good and functional and expand on them in a way that are is, like, like almost breakthrough amounts of, you know, depth, then yes, I can see that, but Oblivion is, even from an RPG standpoint, a very basic, basic game that does schedule sleep during the day and play during the night. It was the opposite yesterday. I slept during the night and played during the day. You were here for that stream, Dafu. I just just, hap just so happened to not sleep the day prior to that. More like Penta's schedule doesn't exist. I think that's the, the thing there, is that it just doesn't exist. Currently. What is this stuff? There's just so many things I want to go touch. And like I said, hey, we've already been live for four and a half hours. Ooh, ah. Don't worry, Dafu, don't worry. I'm just busting your chops. Everybody should know that I'm kind of a finicky person when it comes to things. Fishing spot. I can fish. Wait a second. Wait a second. It's a fishing spot. The important question is... Ooh, saber schnapps. That's really good. The important question becomes... Can I fish? In this game? It's allowing me to sit. It told me I can open my inventory. Oh, don't tell me if I can fish in this game. If I can fish in this game... Literally nothing else will be accomplished. I will walk around and pick up flowers and fish for the rest of the game. Oh my god, it's a spotted hyena. How you doing? Good morning. Long time no see. How's the man? And how's the lady? Ooh. Can I gather the cattails? Does not seem like it. Is this Townberg? This is not Townberg. This is not even close to Townberg. I've just done this. I've just followed the river. <laughs> but there's a quest tipster in here. Oh, it's just another city. What? With a dike. That's that's kind of a pseudo dike, though. It's not a true dike. I appreciate that walnut. I appreciate that. The Dechko. Nice. We found a city. We found a city. We found a city. Motherfucking city. We found a city. We found a city. Gotta go into the city and buy some shit. We got a city, got a city. Oh my god, we got a city. Yeah. Oh my god. Adventure. The adventure of a lifetime. Long, long ago, Henry followed his dreams. And he became the adventurer. Just here with your coffee. I'm here with Red Bull. I am here with Red Bull. I am on the same page, except Red Bull and coffee, slightly different, but similar enough. Thank you, Walnut. I appreciate that, man. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. Nope. 
Knock, 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 knock. Is it failed? Eat a dick. It only failed because my lockpick broke. <laughs> That's... Ooh, lockpicking leveled up. Nice. New skill point. Dog skin. Three dog skins. Three sheep skins. And a whole new shovel. I don't need another shovel. Get out of here. I don't need another shovel. I already got a shovel. Alright. Shut up, dog. I'm lockpicking. Uh, lasting lockpicks, I'm sure, yeah. They'll last twice as long and are more durable. That's really good. Uh, just successfully picking a lock, you have a 20% chance that any broken lockpicks returning to your inventory. It's only 20%. But that's still really good. You have a 1 in 5 chance of any broken lockpicks returning to your inventory. Not just the one that broke the first time. Any lockpicks that broke. So if I'm doing a very hard lock and 6 of my lockpicks breaks, I have a 1 in 5 chance of all of them returning. So I think th this is an interesting thing. I think this is a... An interesting... Choice. Because... You can go the easy way out and say, well, I mean, they're not going to break because they last twice as long. Or you can go with the, the risky one, which is like, they might not last that long, but you also have a chance of them coming back to your inventory. Ooh. Ooh. Do I risk it for the biscuit and just go weak lockpicks that might repair themselves? Or do I go... The, the easy route and say, I'll just, I'll just take the easy path. I'll let my lockpicks last longer. This is real tough. I actually don't like this choice because it makes me, makes me concerned for the, the, the future. My grandpa tried Red Bull once and he said it was like getting a huge kick in the ass. Red Bull is a, yeah, it's a, it's an evil, evil, evil thing, but I love it. This is when I get fired for killing a child. There you go. Don't kill children. I died, took a tested Spanish class, want to know what I got. Uh, 69. Mathematically go for the lockpicks lasting twice as long. But where's the fun in that? Right. Let's plan ahead a little bit. What are the next level of them? What are the level 6 ones? Def grip starting position when lockpicking will be closer to the end of the lock, making it easier to open. Or luck of the drunk. It'll be 30% easier for you to open locks when drunk. But it'll also be 30% noisier. Def grip seems really good. But I might... When I get to level 6, I might just go lasting repairman. I might just do the first two. When I get my next level up. Or my next percent. Because, like, def grip is real good... But lockpicking isn't terribly hard yet. I'm sure I've only been doing easy and very easy locks right now. I haven't even seen a medium lock. I've seen a couple very hards, but I haven't even tried them. I'm going to go lasting lockpicks to start, and on our next level up, I'll decide whether or not I want repairman or deft guy. Or deft grip. Deft punk. You know. Warfare's level three. There you go. And Warfare is just combat with, like, swords and shit, right? Just, yeah, just combat itself. I'll be getting a skill at level 4, though. Oh, there's sword. Level 2. Ooh, 96%. We're going to be getting a level up. Uh, get, we're going to get a perk on our next level up. We need to find someone to beat the shit out of with our sword. We don't have our sword on us. We have an axe. Shit. Oh. Get out of here, or I'll call the guard. <laughs> what are you doing here? Hundred percent, my guy. There you go. Hello. <clears throat> hey, what are you doing here? Clear off, quick girl. What are you doing here? You after something? No. Anything else? 
I'm not trespassing anymore, bud. Fuck off. Fuck off. Hey! Fuck off. Are you serious? Fuck off. Hey! Watch it! No. What are you following me for? What are you doing? What are you even? What are you doing here? This is a fucking town, you dolt. Don't make me kill your ass. What shadow is chasing this time? Or are they coming out because of the dog? Because the dog's barking at me, probably. That would make sense. And because I'm crouching and sneaking around. Is someone there? Nope. Uh, did Yakim get their job done for you then? Don't even remind me. Oh, they're standing in front of my chest that I want to lose. Shoddy piece of work in my life. I had to get it put right after him. I can't believe it. Everyone else praises him to the skies. They all say he's a fine craftsman. If he did it for free, he'd be overcharging. Damn it. I was going to get him to do something for me. And who did you get to fix it? Raymond. He's cheap and does a good, solid job. You take my advice. Talk to Raymond and leave Yakim be. Hmm. I'll bear it in mind. I have seen Sweeney Todd, yes. I have seen Sweeney Todd. It's a good movie. I'm not here. To something. <clears throat> yes. Go away, dog. Go away, dog. Oh, fuck. Yay! Be a bit more careful. What you making? Okay, so it's a, it's a small little village. And there's really nothing of interest on this end of it, so we gotta go up a little more before it becomes interesting. Could be suspicious while you look. True. 
but at the same time, he's a dickweed. Doesn't make him not an asshole. He's just an ass. Got a blacksmith. Hello. Do I know you? Because I'm a blacksmith. God be with you. Ooh, he can actually repair our stuff. It's mighty expensive, though. Let's see how we can haggle this down real quick. Can we do something about the price? Why not? Can we go down to like 42 maybe? What do you say to this? Get a little four four dollars off. Well now. A little more. I'll go forty-three. Agree? Well now. A little I'll go 43.5. All right, so. There we go. I chase Cena a lot with the ring. <laughs> morning, Nightfall. How are you doing, man? Good morning to you, friend. Let's try what you got. What you got. That's actually not that expensive. That's not at that even price. That's not even that pricey. It's not even that pricey, and it's really good. No, 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 no. I don't want to buy it. Get out of here. I want to look at it. Yeah, six stabs, six slash, and two blunt defense. That's not even that bad. That's actually pretty good for 82, 82 bucks. But I am I am buying from a blacksmith instead of a uh, an armorer. I mean, hell, the carpenter's axe isn't even that expensive. And that's just a straight upgrade from what I'm using. I mean, I might want to get a shield. Cooper's Axe? That's also an upgrade. Carpenter's Axe is a bit better, though. Hunting arrows, it's kind of hat. decorated. Oh, that's just a, that's a hat. I thought that was a mushroom. It looked like a mushroom. I have a sword, Dafu. It's just stolen, so I'm waiting for it to uh, become mine. The lo if you if you have something that's stolen property, the longer you own it, uh, it'll actually slowly over time become yours. But the more expensive it is, the longer it takes. And my sword's worth like 400 bucks. So it's going to probably take a while before it becomes mine. Ooh, the robber sword, though, for 99. That's actually not even that bad. 48, 48. That's about as good. That's actually better than the start. The sword we started with. Uh, the epic sword that we started with that we don't, ha don't have anymore. Shard for 36, 44. It's more expensive, though? Why? It's got lower defense, higher charisma, much higher durability. It weighs less. Okay, so there's there's some trade-off for it. I still don't get the modifiers that I've got, because this is 40-40, 48-48, so I've got an 8 modifier to my slash and stab. Somewhere. I'm not sure. Skull cap, small armor's kit, spade, spiked club, spiked club, 37 blunt damage. Ooh, two piece kettle hat. 10, 12, 11, that's real good. Nuri Fox, welcome in. Woodcutter's axe isn't that bad. 27, 26. It's 
It's only a little bit up from me. For your three year anniversary? Aww. You guys are too sweet. Oh, horseshoes for when I get a horse. I gotta keep in mind I don't have a horse yet. How's the stream going? Going well. Thank you for popping in. I don't want to buy the sword because we already have a sword. It's our sword. It's a good sword. We just have to wait before we can use it. And I don't feel like spending all of our money on a sword. So I might buy an axe for the moment because this axe is not going to cut it. Giggity. Uh, so we might buy carpenter's axe. Sell our current axe. Because it's lighter. It's better damage. It's better at everything. It's better defense. It's got higher charisma. It's more durable. Way more durable. Weighs less. It actually does some amount of stab damage. So we're going to pick this up. That one's good for 39. That's 39, 7, 9, 10. That's 82, 9, 11, 10. You guys met on a dating site. I think he told me that before. That's awesome. Putting shit on a nuclear throne does not surprise me, man. You have a good sword that you can't wait to use. Do you not have the stats for it yet? No, there are no stats in this. You don't have stats to use stuff. This is not a game based on stats. Uh, I stole it, and the way this game works is you, the crime is still inactive, or the crime is still active, so I have to keep the sword on me for a long enough time for the guards to, you know, basically wipe the slate clean and it's no longer a crime and then it'll just become my property uh but the more valuable the item just like in real life if you if you steal like a piece of cloth cloth you're probably not going to go to jail but if you steal like a freaking diamond out of a store it's a bigger crime so it'll take longer and my sword is worth like my weight in gold and even more my sword is worth like four 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 hundred and forty or four hundred and fifty gold which is insane so it's, it's just going to take time for it to... If you don't have a strength or agility for a specific weapon, it's not as effective. Yeah, but you can still use it. That's my point. You can still use it. You can use any weapon in this game. You might not be as effective with it, and it's, it's not... It's not about stats. So, like, if I go down here and I look at this, there is no stat requirement. There is no stat requirement for this. There's no stat requirements except for, like, the minimum agility, minimum stuff like that. That's that's pretty much, like, your quote-unquote requirements. But it's not, like... It's not like most RPGs. You can still use it, it's just not as good. Whereas other games, it'll be like, no, you just, you can't, you can't even touch that sword. You can't even touch that sword. Oh, that's also a difference between them. This one's a short sword, this one's a long sword. Which makes sense why the long sword is better at piercing. Makes it better makes it better at piercing because it's a long sword, which is a piercing sword. It's not quite a rapier, but still. I might get the robber's sword. But I don't want another sword. So it's between the old bassinet, which is seven, nine, ten. Weighs four. This weighs three, and it's way better. 
way better. So I'm going to put this in my basket quick. I'm going to put this in my basket quick. That's 154. I've got to have stuff to sell. I would love to have this kettle hat. This kettle hat's real killer. Uh, so if I sell this... Wait. Really, he's only going to buy it for three? That's rough. Oh, there's no way you're going to only buy these for 3.7. That's such a bullshit. My lady at home will buy them for a billion. That's worth 12. That's worth 6.3. I can sell the treasure maps. I wonder if there's a... I could just, like, write down... Hell, I could do this. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Escape. Yes, exit the shop. I'm gonna cheat. There's no hating on this shit. There's no hating on this shit. It's for the loot. It's for the loot. Although I tried to use a bow, I didn't have the min stats for it, and I couldn't even fully draw it back. Yeah. But then again... Let me let me reiterate my my original statements of for everybody is I'm not an expert at this game. I this is my first time playing it. This is an incredibly deep game. I do not claim to know everything about it. I'm going off of my first-hand knowledge, which is I've been able to use everything even if I don't have the stats for it. Quote unquote stats for it. So I yeah. Whether or not that's true, I don't know. So we're going to sell. We'll go to buy first. Buy the carpenter's axe. Yes. Buy you. Yes. Buy you. Yes. Go to sell. Sell this. Yes. Sell. Sell. Sell the trout. Sell the spirits. Sell the sheepskins. I'm not getting full price for him, but what do I care? Uh, Sell these. Yeah. Like I, he'll only buy lockpicks for 3.7 because he's not a one of those kinds of guys. All right, and haggle. 42.4 is what I'm going to pay. I'd like to discuss the price. Sure. Why not? Let's go 25. Is this enough? That's not enough. Thirty. Agree? Well, a little more. Ah. Fine, thirty-five. I knew we'd come to an arrangement. 35. Fine, you got me. Alright, equip the carpenter's axe. Wait, 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 wait. Don't equip that. Equip the carpenter's axe. Equip this. Equip this. So now I've got a felt hat that I can sell as well. I should probably clean it first. Is there a thing I can wash myself in? Yes. 
I wonder if it'll actually clean something that I'm not wearing. Probably not. If I were to guess the... Yeah. So put that on first. Then clean yourself. It should clean the hat. Hopefully. It did. Okay, put the... Put this on. Now that it's clean, it should be worth more. Sell the hat. I'm not gonna need it anymore. Look how good Henry looks. Look at him in his cute little cute little hat. 3.5, that's not that bad. Uh, Close the deal. I'm not even gonna haggle for that. It's not worth it. Not worth it for a couple extra, you know, coins. Am I hungry? I'm not hungry. I am looking to steal some shit, though. No one's an expert yet? Yeah, it's a deep, deep game. And even if it's because it's a deep game... Oh my god! Whoa! Okay, hold on a second. Hold on a... Well, take it all. Take it all. Gonna rob you for all you got. I said, take it all. Take it all. Oh my god, he's got a bunch of good cups. Close the door. I'm not even trespassing, so... Wait a second, that's locked, though. Ooh, salt is actually worth a lot. I'm gonna take the salt and stuff. I'm actually gonna take all that. Salt is worth a decent amount. Cheese and stuff I can eat. Oh, that's just the entire thing that I can steal from. Gotcha. Oh, no. Please don't be anybody in here. Okay, it's a, it's a storehouse. That's perfect. Oh my god, give me that mead, give me that salt. I'll take your bread. I don't quite care for... Is that just that whole pile of stuff that I can rob from? Ooh, more mead! More bread! And beets seem like they're actually worth a decent amount. Oh, trust me, that was not map looking intensified, that was me writing down the maps more or less yeah very easy locks the, the sweet spot on the very easy locks are so big it's it's almost impossible to fail those I think the sweet spot on them is much bigger This one's just an easy lock. Shouldn't be too much of a problem here, hopefully. Where's the sweet spot? Where's the sweet spot? There it is. There it is. Got it. That was real risky. Stealth went up, though. Four bandages, a bludgeon, and a bunch of hides that I can sell to my lady back at the mill. Hell yeah. No, just... Hopefully I don't get searched in the time before I can sell that stuff. Ooh, Tanner, how you doing, bud? Good day to you. I think I was in the middle of explaining something. So, uh, one of the nice things about this game is because it is so deep, there are things that, like... Yeah, there are going to be... Not everybody's going to have all the information because there are so many different ways to play it. Oh, it's stolen goods. That's right. That's all fine with me. I didn't do anything. Shut your damn mouth. I 
I mean, there is a grindstone here, so I could uh, upgrade my stuff if I wanted to. Is there anything that I'm using right now that needs to be sharpened? I mean, I just That's bought... a lot of damage. <laughs> I just bought all this stuff, so I don't really need to upgrade it. I'm actually tentative on going into the village yet. I want maybe want to go back to the mill where I can sell my stolen goods stuff real quick. How far away is the mill that's... Oh, fuck. That is so far away. In fact, they're both, like, equal distance. I'd almost be worth... It's almost worth just running south to here. So you know what that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna run south to there. There's probably not... There's probably not gonna be any guards on the road, let's be honest. I can probably fast travel there if I'm being... If I'm being real real. But you never know. There might be interesting stuff on this road. I'm all about those interesting things. Beehives! Honey, baby! Don't take the honey! Honey, baby! Yeah! Hell yeah! Open the honey. Open the honey. Take the bees. Must have beeches. And everybody stops watching because I said beaches. What? I didn't say beaches, I said beaches. Learn to listen, you fools. Whoa! Henry, what are you doing? Nice vertical, though. On, on a real note, Michael Jordan would be proud. And now I'm just going somewhere else. I don't even know. This game is not good for people with a short attention span like me. Oh, these are farmlands. These are plots. Oh, there's stuff over here. Oh, wait, that's... That's the mill, isn't it? That is not the mill. That's the mill. What is this? What is that? What is the smoke over here? What is it? Oh, that's the beehive. Discovery! Exploration! Gotta find out all the shit. Ooh. There's gotta be like one of those interesting locations out here. Like some cachet. Of like a thief's thief's area, like in one of these tree stumps or something. Come on, game. Please don't have like guards just be like approach me and want to take all my stuff. Just a random camp. Oh, woodcutter. Hello. Jesus Christ be praised. Gotta go back to bed for a little. All right, one. Oh, Walnut. We'll see you later, man. Thanks for popping in. Curiosity. Can I sleep in somebody's bed that is not mine? For an hour. Get the quick... Just a quick little save. At any opportunity I can, I'll take a little quick save. Okay. Vitality leveled up, nice. Am I hungry? 89, I could, I could afford to eat, but I don't think I want to. Ooh, wait a second. Watch this shit. Sleep for seven hours. Sleep till one in the morning. God damn it. Oh, that elbow pop was so tasty. Just like a... So good. Nuri Fox. Thank you for the follow. Welcome into the high mind officially. Glad to have you here. 
Anytime I see that follow notification go off, that means I'm doing something right. Alright, watch this shit. Beige scarf, I'll take. I'll take the bandages. I'll take the black hood. I'll take the bludgeon. I'll take the braise. I'll take the cobwebs. I'll take the dog skin. I'll take the hunting boots. I'll take the loose hose. Giggity. I'll take all that stuff. I'll even take the slippers. I'm so fat. I'm carrying some. You didn't see anything, bud. I'm also gonna eat your food. Now I think it's a smart idea to go find out what this is. Hilariously, it looks like a dungeon, but I know there's no dungeons in this game, so I'm curious what it is. Or at least not traditional dungeons, anyway. There might be, like, mines and stuff, but there's no, like, ooh, goblins. So, what is a foot out yonder? Is this about where it is? Yeah. It's like right out here. It actually looks like a mine. Oh, I discovered a cave! Huh, interesting. There's a cave that I can't go in, though. There are dungeons and castles. Oh yeah, those are my favorite dungeons. Jesus. Pento, why? Brr. Woof, woof, woof. Sadly, no dragons? I'm actually fine that there's no dragons. That makes me actually happy. I know a lot of people are like, Ugh, open world RPG with no dragons. I'm like, that's fine with me. That's actually a good thing if you're asking me. So what is the purpose of the cave then? Might be a side quest there at some point then. I know there's a smoke over here, so there's definitely some. That's not just artistic. I can tell you that. This is not an artistic situation. Let's go back over here. Let's just follow all the river east. Those were porcupines. I could tell you what the caves are for, but I won't. That is probably a good idea, seeing as I have a no spoiler, no backseating rule in my stream. That is probably your best idea. You could have. Man, and I can't fast travel when I'm overweight either. I feel like I shouldn't have picked up everything that I took, but I can't help it. What about the loot? 
The sweet, sweet loots. What I... Uh, I would have to drop, like, nearly 20 pounds. Nearly 30 pounds. It's the heaviest shit I'm carrying. I'm actually not carrying the... A whole lot of heavy shit. I mean, cowhide is six pounds. Those are four pounds. Those are four pounds. Okay, I am carrying... I am carrying a lot of shit, let's be fair. I'm carrying a lot of shit. Four pounds worth of mead. Freaking two pounds of that. Two pounds of wine. Alright, I'm carrying a lot. Let's, let's, let's just, let's just keep going. You can play your loot later. Huh? I am glad that you don't like to spoil and stuff. That means you're gonna fit in perfectly here. Because I don't take spoilers and backseating lightly. This is some of my least favorite stuff in games. So, I'm very happy to hear that. There's, there's nothing, in my opinion, worse than somebody spoiling a game for somebody else. Ruining somebody's gaming experience because you're self- it's a selfish act. I hate that selfishness. In fact, most people spoil shit just to get the person mad. They don't do it because they want the person to know. Twitch chat is notorious for just spoiling things because it'll get the person mad. Nightfall, I didn't even know you were still here, man. Were you still... <laughs> well, I'm okay. I, I, I will agree on a, on a certain degree with you. Uh, lady, I will agree with you sir. a certain hit. Uh, a degree, hyena. That spoiling in any regard is bad, but games... I feel are much more egregious. And there's a very specific reason for that. Because a game is actually a play it's it's a thing the person has to commit to doing it takes more time it is something that is immersive and the person is invested in that thing whereas a tv show i mean a tv show and a game are probably on on par a movie it's it's still still terrible but less egregious than gaming or tv shows because like a tv show you're you're immersed in especially if it's a long-running show if somebody's like Hey, your favorite character dies, and then people are like, what? And then they just like, what's the point of watching anymore? The same with games. Whereas movies, I mean, it's a two-hour experience. It sucks getting something spoiled like that, but... It's easier to move on from a movie. For instance, I'm a massive Fallout fan. I had the Fallout 4 ending, the main ending, rather, spoiled for me before I even got through the ending of it. Do not fall. Do not fall, Henry. I'm walking way too close to the edge of this cliff. And I can't jump. I can't jump. This is this is a bad idea. This is basically what people watch me for. Is to watch me do stupid shit like this, and then I'll die, I'll lose everything, and everybody will get a good laugh on it. Tomika, welcome in! How are you? Please don't walk off a cliff. Oh god, the bushes. They're as tall as me. If not taller. Who's that guy? I don't want to know who that is, actually. Was this lurking? Ah, lurking, lurking, lurking. That's fine. TEW2? I actually don't know what that is. Ah. I got you, Nightfall. I got you, bud. Completely understand, man. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, 
Shut up, puppy. The evil within, too. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, that would make me mad. That would make me mad. Well, that was one hell of an epic journey, now wasn't it? <laughs> well, welcome in nonetheless. Welcome in. Glad to see you again. if it's not going to let me sleep because I've been sleeping way too much lately. Oh, it's only going to let me sleep till 5.30. Mill Papa doesn't wake up until like 8. Ah. Yeah, it tastes like magic. That happens a lot more nowadays, where people are like, well, I mean, come on, everyone knows that they die. It's like, clearly not. Clearly not. Ya dick. Alright, see, the cobwebs and beets and stuff are now mine, because they're not worth a lot. And I've had them, yep, yeah, the, gl the glasses are now mine. See, the stolen symbol's gone, but the stuff that's worth a shit ton more, it's gonna take longer for it to become mine. Like, one of these already became mine. This has already become mine. Yeah. Dog skin's become mine because it's, it's worth less. Sheepskin. The cowhide's become mine, I think. Now, oh, that's Teresa. Maybe, maybe the dad's up yet. Oh, <gasps> no, it's still steel. Really? Really? Does it take that long? Fuck, I don't want it to take that long. I really don't want to wait that long for this sword, man. This goddamn sword. Oh, fuck. God, I don't want to wait that long. Are you awake, Father? Mr. Mr. Mill Papa? Or are you upstairs sleeping? I might as well wash myself. He's probably upstairs sleeping. Yeah, I see his feet. Shit. And I can't do anything, because I have to actually... Oh, wait then. Oh, oh, Jesus. I clicked out of the fucking... My cursor was not in the game. What the hell? That was odd. For some reason, my cursor was on my other monitor. I don't know how that happened. <laughs> Excuse me. Ah, that was a unfortunate clearing of the throat. All right. Yeah, and waiting doesn't save it. Only sleeping does. No, Papa? He's up. 
I wonder if I could wait until stuff becomes mine. That would be an interesting way to cheese it. Just like make sure I had a bunch of food and then just wait, 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 wait until see until it becomes mine. Somebody on the the message hey, board that I went to said it was like for like really expensive stuff it was like 30 hours in game. God save you. But I had imagined like really expensive being like a couple thousand dollars worth, not just a couple hundred. Maybe it's yeah. Maybe it's more than I was thinking. I've got some goods here whose owners might miss them. All right. Let's see what we can do about Hopefully that. Hopefully he has enough money. Yeah, he's got 600 bucks. All right, sell. And he'll actually sell me another treasure map if I need another one. But luckily I wrote it down, so. Uh, I mean, the beige scarf, is that... It's actually better for me, right? I mean, the black hood's really good, actually. But it's stolen. What am I currently wearing on here? I'm currently wearing the red scarf, and the red scarf, I believe, is dead. Correct? Yeah, it's dead. So I'm just going to actually get rid of the red scarf. I'm going to keep the beige one. I'll sell the black one. I'll sell the bludgeon. Zzz. I'll sell the braze. I will sell the cobwebs, because they're worth a decent amount. I will sell the glasses, because these are these goblets are worth a shit ton. That's only worth seven, but the other ones were worth a bunch of shit. The hunting boots are worth a bunch. And they're worse than what I currently wear. Linen is fine. This is worth 35. We are gonna make so much money. Holy shit. Holy shit. Another 26. Another 71. Another 35. Another 10. Another 20. Another 17. He might not have enough money for us. He's not going to have enough money for us. Holy shit, being a thief is good. Well, Nuri, the thing is, is, uh... randomly guards can walk up to you and ask to search you and yes you can pay them off and you can also like do your dialogue stuff through but they will if they do search you they'll take all your stolen shit and you'll have to pay a fine or go to jail or something so and I'm not going to risk having my piercer which is a unique weapon be stolen from me I'm not going to risk risk that so if I put this in here he's just he's not going to have enough money which means that I'm going to actually have to buy some lockpicks. Hilariously enough, I'll be able to buy a lockpick from him to break away even. Does he end up getting more money back? Does he restock his money, quote-unquote, like in other RPGs, or does he just forever now have no money? I'm not even going to haggle. We have so much money. Yeah, these guys again. Interesting that those guys are there again. Never had a random guard walk up to you search you yet? We've had it happen a couple times already. And granted, I'm only like nine hours into the campaign, so No, you're not walking away, lady. You're gonna you're gonna buy my you're gonna buy my hides. Buy my No no Buy my hides, because you buy them for a higher price. Because you are a person who's going to buy them for a higher price. I'm going to sell the beets. I'm going to eat the breads. I'm going to keep the breads. Because they keep for a while, right? They keep for four days. So I'm going to keep those, definitely. Carrots keep for four days as well. Cheese keeps for five days. I can tell you without question that that is definitely not true. If I was walking around with uh, random cheese in my pocket, it would not last for four days. But you know what? It's all good. Sell the salt, sell the sheepskins for 30. Sell the wine. I'm gonna make another 58 bucks. And this time I'm actually gonna haggle. We'll try and get a couple more bucks out of it. Can we do something about the price? 
Naturally. If it was only a couple bucks, I won't haggle, but I'll haggle for like 62. Is this enough? That's better. Hmm. Hold 61. Finally, there you a go. reasonable sum. Scarf. Equip the common shield. I am going to actually eat. No, I'm not going to eat one of my cheese. I will eat the carrot. Because that'll give me a couple nourishment. Bread gives me 17, right? Yeah. Remains edible for many days. And we'll keep properly stored in oh it's properly stored okay so I might have it in like a, a tin or something I'm not sure 739 bucks man we got so much money I got so much money oh my god oh yeah oh yeah we have so much money I can go repair my shoes at a cobbler I don't have any skills yet quest log what can we do Oh yeah, we have to go up here. Wait, did I... Hold on, did I get the fast travel here? I did, okay. Because I don't want to walk all the way back up there. I just want to fast travel here. Can I fast travel there? How long is it going to take? Ooh, Wayfair. Uh, examine. Oh, it's this guy. I've got this plan. Or is this a different guy? This might be the same guy. I don't have any shoes for you. What's it about? You have incredible good fortune, friend. Oh, I have an offer for you, nice. the likes of which comes along only once in a lifetime. Show me All the right. goods. Show me what you're selling. Buying you stolen goods. What has he got? Side eye? For only eight bucks. What is this? The second in the light of the demonic playing dice. What? The second in line of demonic playing dice? <laughs> what? It's the weekend now. It's the weekend for me. It's it's 5 a.m. on a Friday, I think. Isn't it Friday today? Oh, that's Friday today. It's Saturday for you, Tastes Like Magic? How is it Saturday for you? Where the hell are you where it's Saturday? It's not magic. Dafu, it's not magic. It's just a description. The word demonic does not mean magic. Get a dictionary, dude. Should I buy it? I think I'm gonna buy it. You kinda have to, don't you? This is a bad idea, isn't it? This is a bad idea. What do I do with a demonic dice? It's not stolen. What does that do? Can I... Is that something that I can use to, like, cheat in the... In Farkle? Maybe? It's 6 a.m. on Friday for you? Wait, that means you're... Tw oh, it's 6 a.m. on Friday for you, Nico, but... You're in New Zealand. Oh, that explains why you're, like, a billion hours ahead of me, then. That explains it. Well, go back to the map then quick. Go back to the map then quick. And, uh... I mean, honestly, let's just let's just walk across the field. I don't know if I walked across this field in, 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 in good fortune.
All right, I'm gonna get to this town. I'm going to, ooh, sheepsies, sheepies. I'm gonna get to this township, or at least on the outskirts of it, and I am going to not end the stream. That's, that's I know. Typically, when I when I say stuff like that, people expect that. Oh no, he's gonna end the stream. No, I'm gonna get to the outside of the township. Ooh, more beehives. Honey, three honey, three honey. Wait a second. Two honey. I'm gonna get to outside of the township, and I'm gonna take a lunch break. I'm gonna take a lunch break. I'm gonna go get something to eat, use the restroom, get something to drink. You yeah, know the deal. Probably be like 20-ish minutes. Uh, I'll probably just leave the stream running with some music, rather than end it and start it back up. And then uh, we'll come back and play more, uh, Penta Hybrid Peasant. Because I am absolutely loving this game. But that'll be in a couple minutes here. We get to the outskirts of town, because I'd like to come back from the break fresh. I'd like to walk into the town, explore the town, learn about the town, find out exactly what a quest tipster is. What this guy does up here. A quest tipster. I'd want to know what that star guy does. I, I have no idea, but... I am full, right? Yeah, 92. I am well beyond full. Because our, uh, our perk makes our hunger drain so much slower. I thought that was a wolf. This is a piece of grass. It's high noon on Friday for me in the middle of winter vacation. <laughs> Tamika, do not make 9-11 jokes in my chat. I love you to death, but I'm not afraid of banning you. <laughs> do not make 9-11 jokes in my chat. Literally, one of my rules is to not talk about politics. So, yeah, don't do that. That's not a smart idea. This is not a smart idea. Right, this seems like a perfect spot. Such a good game. This is such a good game, and I've barely scratched the surface. I've barely scratched it. All right. I'll pause it here. We are going to... I was born almost a year after it, by the way. You are almost... are about 16, 17. What? What? I was born almost a year after it? I don't care. Listen to me. <laughs> That's not the point. The point is listen. Why is this button not working? Oh, because I'm on that one. There we go. There we go. Let's get some music playing for these fine folks. Let's play some... Uh... 